Hello all, let us do one uh, programming on serial communication through 8051. So, I am considering a program where I am trying to do both serial transmission of data and also a parallel transmission of data. So, if I want to write a representation in the form of a diagram, the diagram would look something like this. I have 8051 here. Okay. So, I am supposed to send bit 1 is asking me to send data y. What is the data? Y through a serial port okay. and they have defined a border rate. We will come to border rate later. So, I am supposed to transmit y serially. Transmit means I am supposed to use a pin txd. What am I supposed to transmit? I am supposed to transmit a letter. So, pin txd means uh, uh, port sorry port 3.1 ok. So, this is the first bit. Second bit is asking you to send n through port 0. So, we know port 0 is parallel communication port. So, I will be sending this data parallelly. What is the data? The data is n through a port. So, here we can differentiate clearly that y is sent serially and n is sent parallelly. With a clear understanding of this, okay. so now let us write or, or do the pre-required calculations. So, the pre-required calculations is first thing he has given you a baud rate of 9600, correct. So, for this we know crystal frequency quickly this procedure we have already seen it. So, I am quickly brushing through it. So, crystal frequency is 11 uh, 0 0.0592 megahertz divided by 12 to get our machine cycles. So, machine cycle is 921.6 kilohertz machine cycle frequency. According to UART, it is again 921.6 kilohertz divided by 32 to get a standard value of 28800 hertz. This is the frequency of serial communication. Now, to calculate preset value ok your 28800 divided by the given board 9600. So, I will be getting um, the ratio like 3 if I am writing in hexadecimal I will write it as 0 3 h. So, when I am where I am using mode 2 timer 1 in mode 2 I will be having the maximum value of mode 2 is 8 bit. So, it is FF minus 0 3 the value will be FCH. This is the value that need to be loaded to the microcontroller to have a board of 9600. So, having calculated the preset value we will now follow the uh, programming steps that we have discussed in the previous video to write a program. We are supposed to load T mod with 20 H. Again repeating why T mod is loaded with 20 H. I am using timer 1 in mode 2 that is 8 bit mode. So, move T mod ash 20 H. Okay, why 20 H? It is discussed in the other video. Please do refer if you have any doubt. And just now we calculated the preset value that I am loading to timer 1 higher flag higher byte what is the value 0 f c h just now we calculated here correct that I am loading into t h. Now, I am supposed to send the data before that I need to load the SCON that is the serial communication control register with the value 50 h. Why 50 h? 
I am sending 8 bit of data with one start and stop bit. Okay, this is serial communication mode 1. Correct? Now, I will start running the time of life. Set bit TR1. What is the data need to be sent serially? Y. Correct? That is given in the question. Mesh Y. Immediate data. So, once I put it here, the data is sent serially. Once the data is completed, there will be an interrupt raised. So, I have to monitor the interrupt. So, I will be checking on the bit on timer interrupt flag. Until this is done, I am just doing nothing here. The data is still being sent. Once timer interrupt flag is raised, that means I have transmitted all the data serially. Okay, first bit of the question is solved. Next, I need to send N to a P0 register, P0 uh, port, P0 hash N. If you want to repeat it, let us say, if you want to keep on doing it, he is asking you here, right? Do it continuously. Correct? So, you have to keep on doing the repetition here. S jump to some loop name called as L2. What am I doing? Again, I am loading 